Hi, I'm Adam. Hey, I'm Joe. How you doing, Joe? I'm fine, man. Prove that you're who you say you are. This is my BBC pass. It's my BBC pass. On the back of my BBC pass are the BBC values. I've talked about this on the podcast before, ages ago. Have you got values on yours? No, I've just got fire safety information. <laughs> fire safety. These passes open any door in the BBC building. If we wanted to, right now, we could go and barge into Radio 2. Not true. Can we? No, they don't open every door. Don't they? Only <laughs> six music doors? Yeah. Really? I've tried it before. Have I tried, you? I tried going up to Jonathan Ross's show when he's got interesting guests in there and having a peek. No. But on the back, check out my values, listeners and viewers, now I can say. Trust! It's the foundation of the BBC. Look at that. It's got capitalised trust. Can you see that? Audiences are at the heart of everything we do. We take pride in delivering quality and value for money. Creativity is the lifeblood of our organisation. The lifeblood! We respect each other. And we celebrate our diversity so that everyone can give their best. So that even idiot holes like you can work here. That's what that line means. We are one BBC. Great things happen when we work together. That means you as well. Actually, no, it doesn't mean you, does it? Because you're not actually part of the corporation unless you've got one of these. I've got a free rental card. Uh, you'll see it's got the six logo. So I can get a free uh, DVD really? rental. Yeah. Got another one there. All six stamped there. It's two free DVD rentals. Plus I've got in my wallet, in case a girl... Uh, I'm chatting up a girl and she looks in my wallet to impress her. A I've got, I've got a dollar bill. Oh, a dollar bill. Now that's proof that I've been to America. Wow. And women love America because it's like a fantasy place where all the Hollywood stars live. Although well, it's a one dollar bill. How impressed is she <laughs> going to be by that? Well, what have you got? I've in got, your wallet. I haven't got my wallet. So I go and get it. I haven't got my wallet. I've also got uh, a receipt there for a, for a DVD from Chinatown in London. What could that be? What's it for? Something sophisticated. Something by Takeshi Miike. It was for Ong Bak 2. Ong Bak 2. Well, it wasn't very good. Don't bother with Ong Bak 2. Look, uh, I've, I've got some. Have you got money. a dollar? No, I've got money, English money. No wonder you don't have lots of Do you know what ladies. I've got in my wallet written down? This is handy. I bet you don't have this. This is how sensitive I am, right? I've yeah. got my wife's measurements written down in case I'm compelled really? to buy her a, a clothing based present. Have you ever used that? Yeah, sure I have. I've got a gold flying club card. That gets me into the first class lounge, even if I'm flying economy. What? Gold flying club. You pawns. Imagine the air miles. What? Jealous now. Of course I'm jealous. How did you get a gold flying club Did a lot of flying. You are such a jammy git. How does he get a gold flying club card? And I've got a blue oyster card. That's uh, for fans of the band Blue Oyster Cult. I haven't got anything. I've got a... Look, here's my uh, Nectar card. This is the one with all the points on it. I'm a member of the Writers Guild of America. Oh, shut <laughs> up. There's my Writers Guild card. There's my driving license. a little license. something I've got there. Oh, that's a nice picture of it's me. A couple of tickets for Amanda Inucci's film In the Loop. Oh, I just went with a bunch of friends. Political satire. Kind of thing you probably wouldn't understand. It's like Mandelson and Blair and they're all swearing. It's very funny. I, I got a message from Will Smith. <laughs> from America, dear Adam Buxton, you are brilliant. Will you come on holiday with that us again this year? That is not a message year? from Will Smith. That's a receipt for twenty pounds for some salmon salad and a three hundred milliliter Pepsi. Oh, but you got a sweet photo there of you and your wifey poo poo. Oh damn it! So, who's won the battle of the wallets? You decide. God damn it! All right, then, take care, listeners. For viewers, I've got to remember to call them viewers. They can see this, can't they? Thanks for joining us this week on the blog. We'll try and do this as often as we can, but we can't guarantee it'll be every week. Have fun, take care, be nice to each other, keep your feet on the ground, and keep reaching for your arse. Bye. Bye.